Are you still looking for the perfect camera strap? Look no further because this is one of the best, if not the best, on the market. Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. My name is Peter if you're new here. Today I'm gonna briefly summarize my thoughts on and provide you with a long-term review of the Peak Design Slide Camera Strap. I've been using them for several years and I bought my first one back in 2016. That was the Slide Summit Edition and I instantly fell in love with it. All right, let's have a look at what's included in the package. You get the camera strap, of course. It also comes with an anchor mount and hex wrench to attach and detach it. Four special anchor connectors are included and a nice microfiber patch for easy storage. The slide is a low profile, adjustable, quick connecting camera strap that is extremely well built, super comfortable and very easy to set up. It's very versatile and you can use it in three different modes. You can use it either as a shoulder strap, but I primarily use it as a sling or a neck strap. I normally have it on as a sling strap, especially when I'm shooting portraits with my 1DX Mark II and when I have a smaller lens attached such as the 35mm f1.4. I always switch to the neck strap variety when I'm out in the field shooting macros and also use it in that mode when I have a larger lens such as the EF 100-400mm telephoto lens attached. I really love the padded nylon webbing which makes it glide over clothing very easily just like with seat belts. There's also a grippy side which prevents it from slipping when used in shoulder mode. I only had issues with the old Summit Edition because the rubbery anti-slip finish started to disintegrate due to heat exposure and I ended up scraping it off but it works just fine. The newer models since 2018 don't have this issue. They changed the material of the gripping to silicon for subsequent iterations so kudos to the developers for that. They also upgraded the nylon webbing in the same year. This camera strap also comes with dual quick pull adjusters which makes the reconfiguration configuration a very smooth experience. Last but not least, I also want to mention the special anchor link system, which is one of the best features of this camera strap. This system allows a very quick connection to the camera and also a very stable one at that because of the double connection points. They also updated these anchors in 2018. They are 25% smaller and are also angled, which makes one-handed connection easier. The anti-abrasion thermoplastic anchors are very durable and crazy strong as well, capable of supporting up to 90 kilograms of gear, which is super impressive. As I said before, I absolutely love these camera straps and for example the straps that come with the Canon bodies are incomparably worse, so much more uncomfortable, I would never want to use those ever again. The slide is very comfortable, super versatile and very easy to use. The ability to quickly adjust and use it in multiple ways and the fact that you can attach or remove it from your camera in a matter of seconds is a huge bonus. I tend to remove them only when I shoot videos on a tripod. For example, with the Canon R7, when I want to use the articulating screen, it can get in the way. I've been using these three camera straps for over five years now. I only had that minor issue, which I talked about before with the Summit Edition. The build quality is exceptional, especially with the newer models. They implemented several upgrades in 2018 and essentially made the perfect camera strap, in my opinion. Anyway, this is my long-term review of the Peak Design Slide Strap. If you want to have a look or purchase either this or the Slide Lite version, I will leave links for you in the description. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and you might also want to check out these next. Thanks again and catch you all very soon in the next one.